Hey guys, one of the new features of Mac OS X is the ability to use tags to categorize your files. So I can right click on any file, I can categorize it as a specific tag. So in this video I'm going to be showing you how to edit your tags so that you can organize them differently, um, choose and select which ones you want to appear uh, within the Finder window. So if you open up your Finder on your Mac, and then on the left hand side you'll see all of your tags listed. Um, you can hide or show the tags by clicking the little uh, button that pops up next to it. Um, but if you click on all tags, the first thing we're going to do is go ahead and edit the names of these tags. So for example, if I want the blue tag to be, um, let's see, there's already a work tag, so we'll just make this um, apartment. And then the gray tag, I want to be something like, actually the green tag I'm going to make, travel. All right, so now if I go to a random file on here, uh, here's just a random mp3 file, here's a list of all of the tags at the bottom, so you can see here I can specify add the tag red, we haven't chosen a different name for that, but if we have the blue one here is apartment or travel, so I'm just going to tag this as travel, um, and then when I go over here to travel, here it shows up. So one other thing, if you go into uh, your Finder Preferences and then click on Tags, you can show uh, or choose which ones show up on the sidebar by checking or unchecking them. So if I want to uncheck everything except for the two that I specified so far, I can just uncheck those. And you can also drag ones to the bottom here as well to order them, you can move them around pretty much anything you want. So super easy to use, tags are pretty awesome, it's a good way to categorize files so that you can just see all of your files listed in one place instead of having to dig through tons of different folders. So thanks for watching, if you have any questions about this or any other topics let me know and I'll definitely try to make a video for you.